Representative Orcutt, just nine days remain in the 2024 legislative session with adjournment scheduled for March 7th. Tell us what we can expect here in the home stretch. Well, first, hopefully we'll get at least some of the initiatives passed. No guarantee there, but three of them have been heard. And so I'm very glad that, that we had hearings on those. I would like to see those get passed. I am disappointed that the other three have not received hearings. The good news about that is that it goes to the voters in November. Uh, but in the home stretch, we're finishing out passing bills from the opposing chamber. So House looking at Senate bills, Senate looking at House bills. Then the final week of session, we go through and we will look at any of the differences between the House version of a particular bill and the Senate version and figure out if we can come to agreed language and both chambers pass the bill in the exact same form with the exact same language. And then the other thing that we'll need to do is uh, finalize the three supplemental budgets. Those budgets were written for a two-year period starting last year, so they're good for you know almost another year and a half, but there have been some things that have happened since those were written, so there are some adjustments that are being made uh, mid-course. So those three budgets will also have to be passed, operating, capital, and transportation. So we should be seeing supplemental budgets from those three and voting those out before we adjourn on March 7th.